case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 2002, the New York Supreme Court Appellate Division heard the case of Inri Monahan, which revolved around the professional conduct of lawyers and the consequences for racially abusing opposing counsel. The respondent, a lawyer, had violated professional responsibility codes by racially abusing opposing counsel during a deposition. The petitioner sought disciplinary action, but the respondent contested the accusations, claiming there was insufficient evidence. A special referee was appointed to hear the case and found that the respondent had indeed engaged in inappropriate conduct. The respondent subsequently apologized and agreed to a public censure. However, the respondent argued that the misconduct was not racially motivated, but rather gender-related, a defense ultimately denied by the court. The misconduct in question occurred during a United States Department of Labor proceeding, where the respondent continually harassed a black woman conducting the deposition. Despite being warned by Judge Mukasey, the respondent persisted and was fined $500. Ultimately, the court censured the respondent for their professional misconduct. Given the respondent's disciplinary history and the circumstances surrounding the case, a public censure was deemed an appropriate sanction. The respondent was prohibited from engaging in similar misconduct in the future. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSE.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.